I'm Mark Gillies and I'm Manager of Product and Technology Communications for Volkswagen of America. Well, the first hybrid obviously was the Prius in the late 90s. And since then, the hybrids have got a lot more refined. Their fuel consumption has actually got better. But I think the biggest advantage is the battery technology has come on greatly. You know, you've got a lot more energy density in the batteries, so you get a little bit more electric range. The Jetta Hybrid has a slightly different system to everybody else's. I think, to a certain extent, you know, we with the Jetta Hybrid want a car that's fun to drive as well as um, an eco-friendly car. Um, so there's no real compromise with our vehicle, whereas some of the other hybrids on the market, you're not gonna have a lot of fun driving them. Most of the other hybrids on the market use naturally aspirated engines with a continuously variable transmission. We, instead of that, we have a dual clutch DSG automated manual transmission, which is mated to um, a turbocharged direct injection engine. And manufacturers have made a lot of effort to get better aerodynamics. Um, and one of the things with our hybrid model, for instance, is it's actually the quietest Jetta in the lineup. We have special acoustic glass in the front and front passenger windows. Um, we have a different exhaust system. We've made a lot of effort to get the noise down so that when you're running in electric mode, it's really, really quiet. We're looking to get people who are in the market for a hybrid. We're looking for people who actually want to enjoy driving the car. The situation nowadays is that the market is expanding for hybrids. Currently, it's 3% of all cars sold in the US. We're predicting, or we've been seeing predictions that the market will grow to 6% by 2020. Essentially, you know, we, we think that when we look at our buyers, they tend to be a little better educated, have a little bit more money than necessarily the same people in the same segment. So we felt it was important to get into the hybrid market and particularly as it's a very uh, important stage onto full electrification of vehicles. There's not going to be a, a wholesale change over to electrified vehicles, you know, battery electric vehicles, but we're going to see gradually a lot of cars going to plug-in and full hybrid status. So obviously we want to be out with that technology in the market because it's a growing area.